there are many dangerous things that can poison your dog. Due to their natural curiosity, dogs explore the world around them by smell and taste, and they may ingest various household items that may be potentially poisonous. Human food Just because food is good for us doesn't mean it's safe for dogs. Chocolate contains high amounts of caffeine and theobromine, which dogs do not tolerate well. This can lead to various disorders ranging from gastrointestinal, cardiac, blood pressure disorders and a few others. Other things being equal, dark chocolate is more toxic. The toxic dose is calculated using the weight of the dog, the type of chocolate, and the amount of chocolate the dog has ingested. Be sure to contact your veterinarian and tell him this information so that he can tell you what steps to take. It is often recommended to induce vomiting if the meal has been within the last two hours. If severely poisoned, your dog should be hospitalized and on a drip. Chocolate is generally the most common cause of food poisoning, but there are others. Grapes and raisins can cause acute kidney failure, macadamia nuts can lead to gastrointestinal upset, tremors and weakness. Avocados can cause vomiting and diarrhea. Sugar-free gum contains xylitol, which can cause dangerously low blood sugar levels. Signs of low blood sugar are weakness, loss of coordination, tremors, and seizures. Since human food is generally fatter and spicier, dogs that overindulge in regular human food tend to suffer from gastrointestinal distress, which in severe cases leads to inflammation of the pancreas. Never allow your dog to eat your regular food, and always inform your friends and guests about this. Rodenticides, poisons for rodents. The bait for mice and rats is made in such a way as to be appetizing for them. But, unfortunately, for the same reason, the dog may find this bait edible. Until now, many of these baits are made on the basis of an anticoagulant that blocks vitamin K and leads to massive internal bleeding and death of any rodent. Dogs experience the same bleeding, but because dogs are larger, death usually occurs after three to five days without treatment. If the dog has recently ingested poison, it is necessary to induce vomiting in it as soon as possible and seek veterinary help. Your veterinarian will prescribe vitamin K to the dog, and for two to three weeks you should monitor him for lethargy, weakness, and loss of appetite. If you notice any of these symptoms, contact your veterinarian immediately. In exceptional cases, the dog may need a blood transfusion. Insecticides, insect repellents. The most common insecticide ingested by dogs is roach control. They contain an attractant that is similar to peanut butter and that attracts dogs. Fortunately, insecticides that are used today are practically non-toxic to mammals or their dose in baits is very small. However, there is another danger, namely the container of poison, as the dog may swallow it whole. Therefore, when placing the poison, you must follow the same rules as in the case of rodenticides. Medical preparations. This category includes various medicines intended for humans. Ibuprofen and parastimol are poisonous to a dog and you should never give them to it. Keep all of your tablets out of your dog's reach. Various bottles and potions may not be accessible to children, however, many of them remain accessible to the dog. If possible, take your tablets in the bathroom with the door closed so that if you accidentally drop a tablet, your dog cannot catch it and swallow it. If your dog has swallowed a pill or is showing signs of poisoning, Contact your veterinarian immediately and give them the details of the medication ingested so they can determine the next steps you need to take. Veterinary Medicinal Products Many of the pills that veterinarians prescribe for dogs taste good, causing dogs to consider them a treat. It is important that all medicines for your dog are kept in a safe place. If you are giving your dog medication, Make sure you know the exact dose and schedule for taking it, so be sure to ask these questions before you leave the vet's office. Never use dog flea and tick treatments on your cats as these dog and cat treatments are fundamentally different. Plants Plants are more of a problem for cats than for dogs. However, many puppies and even adult dogs will chew on plants when they have stomach problems. Toxic plants can be daffodils, oleander, rhododendrons, 
cyclamen, yew, and chrysanthemums. Find out what plants you have in your garden and remove any toxic varieties from there. If you're not sure if the plants are safe, it's best to keep your dog away from them. Fertilizers Another reason to keep your dog out of the garden is fertilizer that smells like dog food. There is a large variety of fertilizers that contain nitrogen, potassium and phosphorus as well as a small amount of insecticides and herbicides as additives. If you use such fertilizers, then keep your dog away from them, or use organic-based fertilizers. Cleaning Products Many cleaning products are poisonous to both humans and dogs. Keep all such products locked up and consider using natural and organic cleaners. If your dog has swallowed bleach or cleaner, do not induce vomiting. Contact your veterinarian and tell them the name of the product and the approximate amount your dog has eaten, he will tell you all the necessary next steps. Heavy Metals As a rule, the most dangerous metals for dogs are zinc and lead, and the cause of poisoning is the ingestion of small metal objects such as coins. A sign of such poisoning will be gastrointestinal upset and anemia. The best treatment in this case is prevention, so keep your change out of your dog's reach. Various Chemicals Antifreeze is very sweet and attracts many dogs. After drinking even a small amount of antifreeze, the dog becomes very drunk. However, after a few hours the dog will become sober and quite normal, but after a few days he will definitely have kidney failure. The toxic ingredient in antifreeze is ethylene glycol. There is an antidote for it, but it must be used immediately after taking antifreeze, so if you suspect your dog has taken it, contact your veterinarian immediately. Much less toxic antifreeze based on propylene glycol, so buy it if possible. Besides antifreeze, there are many other chemicals that are dangerous to all pets. These are substances such as paints, paint thinners pool chemicals. If a product is labeled as poisonous, then keep in mind that it is poisonous to animals, and keep such products out of reach. Be prudent and prepare a first aid kit for your dog in case of an emergency. In addition to the basic items that should be in the first aid kit, do not forget to put in it a 3% solution of hydrogen peroxide and a small syringe with which you can induce vomiting in a dog. Also, do not forget to add saline to it in order to rinse the eyes of the animal if necessary.